So I traded a rabbit for a dozen hatching eggs, and we got two, but unfortunately the two that we got hatched like really early before the other ones, and um, one of them didn't survive. So this is the only survivor out of that dozen eggs, but um, he seems to be doing okay. I feel kind of bad because he's alone. I tried to put him with a mommy and it didn't work out, so he's just hanging out in the main house. Hi, little guy. He's curious. And, uh, yeah, we'll get to see him grow up, hopefully. We got this mama and baby. They seem to be doing okay. I've got them in here temporarily, but I just moved out that group. So I need to take that back over and put it somewhere new. And then figure out how I'm going to herd these guys out of here and into there. They seem to be doing alright. Hi, duck ducks. Can't really put the duck ducks in the category of babies anymore. Because they're pretty much full grown. And the same with the bantams. All the bantams I've got. So I've got two boy bantams and two girl bantams. Got a little bit more cleanup to do. Moving things around. Because I need to move this pin. Well, never mind about that. So, these are my other two bantams. They're not really babies anymore because he started crowing. So, I got these two and these two, and I need to move these two into here soon, but I've got to get a, a net or something to put over the top first because honey here know how to jump out. Here's these mama and babies. I just let them out from the run back there yesterday so that they can start wandering around. I'm hoping that so far mama seems to wander off and the babies seem to stay here, which is fine. Um, but I'm kind of hoping that because they were raised by mom here, she will teach them how to not just disappear like all of my other babies have so far. If that's not the case, then that means that I just need to wait until my babies are like, oh wow, 100% Wow, it's not registering. Okay, 100% grown up before I let them out. All right, and here's the last group. Mama and two babies. I just moved them in here. They still got a little growing to do. They're technically the third oldest group. It's this group, and then it's the group with the single baby, and then it's this group. But because she's only got one singular baby, I didn't... All right, well, um, we did have seven kits this month. Miss Kibley did have seven healthy kits, but unfortunately, for some reason, she thought it was a really good idea to be in her nesting box, like, all the time. She was jumping in and out of it all the time, and so she squished all of her babies. So we don't, we don't have any. Um, these four are boys. And then I've got this little boy in here as well. He'll be old enough to butcher next month. Technically so will he, but I'll probably wait. More than likely I'm going to end up butchering all four of them. Because um, I've already sold all of the girls. And then there's this female. This, she's um, Miss Kibley's daughter from her last litter. And her name is O'Hara May. She is going to be replacing... Um, I believe it's sugared. One, two, three, four. Yeah, she's gonna be replacing sugared, cause sugared is not giving me any babies like at all. I haven't had any luck. Um, despite that, I have bred sugared nut for next month, and I've bred her for this next month. Um, she was being a pain though, so I don't know if she actually took. Uh, if not, unfortunately, that's a strike on her record. But hopefully, we can get past that. So yeah, that's what's going on with the rabbitry, baby wise. And one more surprise. that none of us knew about but our little Miss Muffet had a little Miss Muffet it's a heifer now the guy who runs the cattle out here these are his cattle um, has graciously let us just leave Muffet with his herd since she so badly wanted to have um, companions and we were just sick at the time so we, anyways, she managed to have a baby, and it's adorable. 
but even he didn't notice that she was pregnant and he's out here a lot off more often than we are so this is uh, a half highland half angus heifer and i think we're gonna call her Miriam, but i don't know but just look how adorable she is very tiny All right, it's September. There's not an awful lot to update for babies. This guy's doing well. I moved the last mom and baby from there over into the coop, and we're not getting any baby rabbits this month and probably not next month because O'Hara is still too young to breed. She will be next time around. Um, yeah, so not, not a lot of baby updates, but I am going to go look for um, baby cow. Uh, I went the long way around. I've been wandering our property all over the place looking for the herd, and I finally found them. So there's Muffet, and there's Baby. Already it looks like she's gotten a little bit bigger. Uh -oh. Seem to be okay. How's she doing? How you doing? Hmm? Frogs everywhere. Hello, baby. I think you've gotten a little bit bigger. Look at you. How you doing, Mama? I didn't bring any treats out today. I just wanted to check on you and your baby. Make sure you guys are doing okay. Look at her. and she's so cute? Yeah, she'll let me come up to her. Mama might not either. <laughs> yeah, she's a little protective. All right, all right. Won't come any closer. But she seems to be doing okay. So that's all we need to know. Mama, huh, she's doing good. You're doing a good mama thing. Good. <laughs>